hard to believe it has been 40 years since we first met Cricket Blair on The Young and the Restless. And through the years, viewers have been there for her loves and losses as she became one of the show's leading ladies. And how cool is this? Joining us today ahead of a special episode airing tomorrow is actress Laura Lee Bell. Good morning. Good morning. Yes, loves. But I've only had two loves. That's pretty good for some loves. <laughs> that is pretty good. I mean, I was reading so much about you. Let's go back, Laura Lee, to the beginning. I believe that I read when you first started out on the show, you originally thought you would only be there for two days. How is this possible? I know. Well, it was, it, yeah, it was, it was for sure only going to be two days. And, um, you know, I have to make this very long story short, but back in, in that time, they're just young people on soap. So, uh, there were some fan letters that came when we were, you know, when I was young saying, hey, I always watch and uh, I'm, you know, a, a however old person and my grandkids or my kids were walking by and suddenly they sat down with me. And how cool is it to have a younger person who's actually young, not a 25 year old playing a 13 year old. Um, and so I mean, the long story short is it just uh, it evolved to summer storylines. And uh, Trisha Cast came in, and Tom Beards came in, and and one thing led to another, and and Young and Restless became half young suddenly. <laughs> <laughs> the show has evolved throughout the decades. Your character has matured. Let's talk the names, though. Christine versus Cricket. Is there a preference here? What do we need to know? I mean, you know, if you've been watching a long time. I think you, you do you go with cricket I go with cricket personally um, we with this anniversary episode we have some the people that have been with my character the whole time so the few of them call me cricket um, of course you're gonna have Phyllis who who is not a fan of mine um, either calling me Christine or the bug um, you know <laughs> you'll hear every name um, and I, I love it all it's sort of like you know you, you can figure out how you fit into my life by what you call me. <laughs> That's really what keeps it fun. And that really does speak to the loyal fan base that the show has. They really have always been there, you know, day in and day out, year in and year out. It must make you feel so good. It, it makes me feel amazing. Uh, so many people say that they've gone on this ride with me. They started when they were young. They um, have had children they were watching when they had children. And now their kids are going off to college and they're still watching. and. You can't beat that kind of comment. I mean, it's never, I, I, every time I, I see something written like that, I stop and I kind of imagine what this person would be like. And, you know, somehow I feel like it just, you know, it does bond us because, um, you know, we, as we've been together all these years and I'm so, so grateful. I, I, I can't say thank you enough to the fans and, um, I know, I really hope they like this episode. Yeah, that's what it's all about. Let's talk about that special episode coming up tomorrow, correct? Tomorrow, tomorrow yes. Um, yes, you'll see, you'll see some, you'll see every emotion, okay? I'll be battling it out with this. I'll be smiling with Nina, crying with Nina. Um, we see uh, my old relationship with Paul, which is so wonderful. Um, Doug Davidson is you know, such an amazer, and then I have uh, perhaps I might stumble upon my my first <laughs> husband, Danny. Um, you know, I don't want to give too much away, but it's a I'm basically saying there is a little bit of everything. Everything you're gonna, you know, you'll feel you'll feel all you'll have the feels. Definitely, that <laughs> is what it's all about. Well, Laura Lee, thank you so much for making some time for us, and congratulations on 40 years. This is a great accomplishment. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. You bet. You can, of course, watch the special episode. You know, well, before we wrap this up, I always thought I'd make a good scorned ex-lover on The Young and I think the Restless. You yeah, I, I just, yeah, I'm throwing that out there to the producers. But <laughs> enough about that. The special episode tomorrow, 12.30 p.m. right here on WPRI 12. I really